There we go. The Liverpool supporters still inside the ground. You can hear them singing the name of their new manager. Very well done. How pleasing was that all round for you today? Yeah, very pleasing. I think we saw all the things you want to see. There were difficult moments in the game for us. We started. I think United were very aggressive in the start. We came through that. And then we had a goal disallowed. We came through that. So we were mentally really strong today. And with the ball, I think uh, we saw an excellent performance as well. Did you expect it to be that control today? You really had control of the game? Yeah, you hope for it, of course. Um, expect is not the right word. I think I said before the game to the players that there will be difficult moments today and then you have to fight yourself through. So till now with Ipswich and Brentford, we only had the positives and then that you work hard, OK, that I can understand. But I want to see how it is if it's tough. And there were tough moments today, and I think we constantly saw how aggressive we were, how, how much we ran without the ball, and uh, deserved to win, I think. Arnie, congratulations. I was just wondering, the three goals that, that Liverpool scored today, all from pressure that you caused uh, mistakes in the midfield, was that a specific target from you today, or was that just how you like your team play, winning the ball in midfield and breaking quick? Yeah, I think the way Liverpool likes to play in general, and, 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 and I'm the same like this so we want to press high as high as we can uh, we know with the type of players we have because they can run very good but if they arrive in a duel they're really strong uh, so the three midfields we have with Maka with Dom and with uh, Ryan they can run and they can arrive in a duel and um, and they kept and they kept running so we won the ball back a few times but I think the first goal we scored which was disallowed which came not from a pressing situation mm. my football heart would have loved that goal to count <laughs> unfortunately it didn't <laughs> Yeah, Arne, congratulations again. I think your first 11 are very strong, but also we, we were just sat two rows back and we see the subs walk past, uh, sorry, warming up and think, that is such a strong squad. That's going to be a tough part of your mm -hmm. job this year to try and keep all them players happy. Yeah, I think it's impossible to keep a player happy if he's not playing, yeah. uh, but uh, they now go to the international team, play two games, come back, I think in 21 days we play seven games. Yeah. So the, the schedule is crazy, so you need these amount of players. The good thing for us is that they're all fit, so that's why you see them as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's it's always. I, I also saw some some players in the dressing room. They were happy, but in a different way than the ones that uh, that played, of course. Yeah. And apart from the goals and the wins, three consecutive clean sheets yet to concede. And you said about that foundation to go and play. How pleasing is that? Pleasing. Although in the second half we needed Allison two times, uh, which is normal if you play United away. That 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 you sometimes need your goalkeeper, but in an ideal situation. Uh, he's only there to play out from the back, but we needed him two times and in those moments the game can change We all know they better than me how uh, things can uh, can change over here if they would have scored a goal But it was good to see that in the end we kept uh, control over the game and yeah, I said it before <laughs>